But if you fast forward 13 years to 1941, penicillin has proved so difficult to scale and test that only five people in world history have ever been tested with penicillin, and two of them have died. So imagine like being a journalist in 1942, like asked to write about this new technology called penicillin. Like your first paragraph is like, it's been tested in phase one clinical trials and 40% of the population is dead. Um, it doesn't sound very promising, but it's brought to America when the Niebuhr Bush and several other people are launching OSRD, the Office of Scientific Research and Development, which is this all of government effort to update American science and technology. It births the Manhattan Project. It helps us invent radar. And it very importantly helps us really invent penicillin. I mean, not just you know find the molecule itself, but grow it at scale, test it, and then manufacture it at massive scale and ship it out all, all over the world. Um, by the end of the war, 1945, uh, the rates of disease, rates of bacterial death among um, British and American soldiers declined by a factor of 18. That's very good. And penicillin becomes maybe the most important medical breakthrough of the 20th century.